seeing Christina only made me miss her more. Just, I feel this empty space inside of me that used to be filled with love, and I can't keep feeling like that, Jason. I want to have another baby. Sam, I know. I know the truth. And having another baby seems like a way to make it stop, but you need, you need time to heal your body emotionally. I think becoming a mother will be all the healing I need to feel that little person growing inside me again. It would just make the world seem yeah, right, it's too, Jason. It's, it's too soon to be talking like this. You and I were going to raise my child together. You lost what I lost. Don't you want another chance? Look, getting pregnant made me a better person. I just don't want to lose that. Sam. You were always a good person. Getting pregnant didn't change you as much as you think. Trust me, Jason, all I ever thought about was myself. That's not true. I've seen you with your brother. But it's not the same thing. Why not? Because Danny... Danny is sweet and, and trusting. He's like a little kid. I always had to think for the both of us. You were willing to go to jail to protect him. I'm all he has. I love him a lot. Right. That love was a part of you before you were pregnant. It's a part of you right now, and it's always going to be there whether you have another baby or not. You miss the baby. As much as I do. Why should we go on like this? Just aching. For her. We could have another baby. Jason, why not make a child for both of us to love? Sam, I don't understand. I, I know that you're in pain, and I know that you're afraid you're always going to be, but you'll heal. With time, it's going to get easier, but having a baby is not the answer. Hello, Sam. How are you feeling? Great. Dr. Meadows, how soon could I have another baby? It's not uncommon for women who've lost a child to want to conceive again quickly. But in your case, it won't be possible. Why not? When the abruptio placenta occurred, it caused extensive bleeding in your uterus. At one point, your doctor considered a hysterectomy. Without my permission? Can he do that? Well, if your life is at stake, he would have no other choice. But fortunately, it didn't come to that. Can I still have children? Absolutely. Absolutely. But your body needs time to recover. And there's no telling how long that'll take. What would happen if there were an accident? Or At best, the pregnancy would be difficult to sustain. At worst, it could be fatal. You are more fragile than you realize, Sam. And if you push yourself too soon, you could put your own life at risk. When I went... Do you remember that little... jumper gown that I bought? The one with the, the pink polka dots? Well, I laid it out on the bed last week and, and I put it over my shoulder and I 
held it tight, pretending my baby was in it, and I just, I danced around the room. If anyone would have seen me, they would have thought I was crazy for sure. Not me. Jason, do you believe in heaven? That somewhere, there's a God looking down on us? Yes, I do. What about proof? When I, you know, when I stand by the ocean looking out to the horizon, I, you know, I can't, I can't explain it. I just feel like I'm part of something. You know, bigger than myself. And that's all the proof I need. For me, it's the stars. Just looking up in the sky and feeling small and important at the same time. Scared. Yet happy to be a part of it. Do you think there's stars in heaven? I think there's everything you want for the baby. Love, security, happiness, and stars. and safe. Here near Christina, I don't want you near Sam. Jason, How many times do I have Jason, to tell stop. you? Alexis saved my life. He's we were able to treat Sam before hypothermia set in. Now, Sam, I have advised you to stay in bed in the past. This time it's an order. Mm -hmm. Thanks. I'll uh, leave you to it. 